and today we're gonna cook like Julia. So join me, will you? First off, we better open the wine. <laughs> oh, Julia always cooked with wine. Look. Yay! So, that's what we will do. Bon appetit. Okay, we're gonna start with cutting the chicken. Slice it. I've already bathed it. Oh, oh. All right. Well, now that that is done, um, I, I have ridded my cutting board of the contaminated chicken, and um, apparently that knife was too sharp. So. Um, We're going to get a different one. Now we're going to chunk up this chicken because we are going to saute it in a beautiful <clears throat> cola vita from Italy. It's balsamic vinegar from Italy. Delish. Now as we cut the chicken, a few things about Julia. She was fabulous. And did you know that she worked for the CIA? I didn't know that. And then she took up the art of cooking. And the rest, as they say, is history. <laughs> okay. It's taken a while. All right, cut. <laughs> All right, we are heating up our olive oil, and we are ready for the chicken. Just a few. As we wait for that to heat up, I'll take another drink of my white wine. White wine, by the way, pairs wonderfully with chicken dishes. All right, here we go. Oh, okay. Um, pay no mind to that. Okay. Um, so we're gonna put the chicken in the pan so you can saute it up ever so deliciously. Woo! Come on! Let's turn that down. Okay. I'll turn that down. I'm gonna put this in the sink because we don't want salmonella everywhere. <laughs> the floor. Okay. This isn't your typical Christmas type dinner, but it is a wonderful alternative to turkey. You're going to get our pepper and salt, ground that up, add that. Oh, yeah. That is so delicious. And salt kicks in the flavor. Yes. Delish. Okay. I'm going to pour a little wine in there. Wonderful. Pour a little wine in here. It's looking good. Looking delicious. All right. We will heat up the potatoes. Oh wait. Okay, turn on. 
States. No, what? Oh. <laughs> All right, maybe I'm in too much wine. <laughs> Let's turn this dial. We're just going to ever so slightly turn that on just to heat them up because I, I pre-cooked our mashed potatoes. I mean, yeah. Okay. Now let's hang that. Let's see where we're at with our chicken. <laughs> oh, it's looking good. All right. <clears throat> we want to make sure it's cooked. We don't want any visitors from Sal. Sal Manila. <laughs> oh, all right. Well, okay. Now well, it still has to cook. So let's just wait and then we'll drink more wine, okay? Okay. Okay, we're going to put some butter on the potatoes because you know it and I know it. Everything tastes better with butter. You got that. <laughs> Alright, well, this chicken is taking longer than what I had anticipated, so we're going to cover it. Cover the chicken and it will cook faster. Okay, we're gonna whip the potatoes, whip the stuffing right out of them. Yeah, okay. Right, we had to turn the vent on because it's getting a little hot in here. Woo! Okay. okay, now when you add the balsamic vinegar, again, this is from Italy, it's delicious. We're going to turn down the heat. We don't want it too hot. Now, this is going to caramelize a little bit, which is going to be totally delicious, and you're going to love it. Okay, so we're going to add, whew, we're going to add a teaspoon. Oh, oh, sorry. Okay, as we wait for the balsamic vinegar to cook down, um, Bon appetit. Balsamic vinegar, fun fact, is not made or does not contain balsam. However, it is made from grapes, so that makes it extra delish. <laughs> so is wine. Our delicious dish. Turn off. Oh, I turn that off. Okay. Um, so we're gonna put our potatoes on our plate. I didn't. I, I didn't have my nice plates. Okay. And then we're gonna add the chicken. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have my camera person um, taste it to see how good it is. Cause it's, I'm sure, I'm sure it's good. I mean, it's a balsamic vinegar chicken. Oh, I forgot your Hawaiian roll. Mm mm. That ends the segment of Julie cooking like Julia, kind of. Uh, uh, Merry holidays, happy Christmas.